Hey, Karen, I'm testing my microphone. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Oh, okay. I'm doing headsets today because I've got visitors in the house. And four. You look like a telephone operator. <laughs> Who was it, Lily Tomlin? L Lily, Lily Tomlin. <laughs> I could actually potentially dress up as her. <laughs> and, and do the one ringy dingy, two ringy dingies. Yeah. <laughs> one ringy dingy, <laughs> two ringy dingies. <laughs> <laughs> I do think that you have to be of a certain age to know that, you know, you get to the age where you, you start saying that you have to be of a certain age to laugh at that. Well, I see that we're all here and it is three o'clock by my clock anyway, and the one on my iPad. So let's go ahead and, and get this going here. So the January 12th, 2020, uh, 2020, 22 regular meeting of the Yosemite Community College District Board of Trustees is hereby called to order at 3 p.m. or 1500 if you're looking at your military clock. This governing board meeting is conducted pursuant to AB 361 and YCCD resolution number 21-22.09. Good afternoon, everyone. We thank you for your patience as we continue to navigate this virtual platform. We welcome the board members and others who are participating via Zoom. Please be advised that everyone participating via Zoom video or call has been muted with the exception of the board members, student trustee and chancellor. We also welcome any members of our district community and the members of the public who are viewing the meeting live via YouTube. Members of the public are welcome to record this meeting using their own personal devices. The district will also make the recording available on the YACCD YouTube channel for 30 days in accordance with our board policy 2365 recording. As a reminder, board members are asked to use the quote raised hand end quote feature via Zoom when they wish to speak. Everyone is encouraged to mute their audio when not speaking to minimize disruption. The board is open to receiving public comments. The published agenda requested public comments be submitted in advance of the meeting by email. Public comments will be read aloud by staff at the appropriate time during the meeting. Persons seeking to make an in real time public comment may do so at the time of the agenda item and are asked to use the quote raised hand end quote Zoom feature. I will now ask that a roll call be taken to establish a quorum. In addition to confirming that you are present, I'll ask that you also respond to the three questions listed in the agenda, which were or are. Can you hear me well? Were you able to hear our proceedings on this end until now? And do you have a copy of the agenda for this meeting? Uh, Trustee Antonio Aguilar. Present and yes to all three questions. Vice Chair Leslie Beggs. Yes, and yes to all three. Uh, Board Chair Darren Garrett. Present and yes to all three. Trustee Nancy Hinton. Present and yes to all three. Trustee Jenny Nicola. Present and yes to all three. Trustee Milton Richards. Here and yes to all three. And Trustee uh, Margie Bogan. Present and yes to all three. Form is established. Thank you. Uh, moving on to item 2.3, statements of conflict. I would ask trustees to declare any conflicts of interest at this time on any particular agenda item listed on the agenda. For the record, conflicts of interest disclosed will be noted in the official minutes. Any raised hands, blinking of the eyes, jumping up and down? No, I don't see anything. All right. 2.4, public comments. This time I asked the board stenographer to first read aloud any public comments or CV email and introduce in real time public comment request. Please note all email correspondence relating to this meeting will become part of the board minutes. Board stenographer. Chair Garrett, there were no public comments received via email. Uh, at this time, I'll see if there's any raised hands in the room. Is 
Is in a phone, there are no raised hands. Okay. So with the musical introduction, we'll now adjourn to closed session at 1504 uh, hours or 304 p.m. Uh, the items uh, listed uh, for closed session are 3.1 uh, discipline to missile release and appointment uh, to, um, in accordance with government code section 54957. 3.2 in accordance with government code section 54956.9 per ND per N2 conference with legal counsel anticipated potential litigation one potential case. 3.3 pursuant to government code section 54957.6 conference with labor negotiators employee organization the uh, California School Employees Association agency negotiator senior director of human resources Catherine Pritchard and 3.3 pursuant to government code section 54957.6 conference with labor negotiator employee organization Yosemite Faculty Association agency negotiator Modesto Junior College President uh, Santanu Barapadier. So with that, we'll move into a closed session. We'll see you on the other side.